I wonder if they'll still text back, even though. Which yeah. corner? I hope your phone's not dead. I'm there. Don't text them back, though. <laughs> <clears throat> I noticed a lot of people are using the let's get textual and then they're texting back, like they're quickly relieving the tension. Don't, Don't let, relieve the let, tension. Let the tension build. Sit. Uh, welcome to Good Mythical More. I d I, I don't want to let the tension build in terms of me finding out where I'm going to be in 20 years. I know they've prepared one for me. Can I please see it? Come on. I did a good job hosting. Yeah, go for it. Let's, let's just check it out. Oh, you'd be dead. <laughs> Life was tragically cut short when Edward Coleman forgot to boil bull testicles for safety. Oh, and that's only that's only that's next year, man. <laughs> the, wow, that's heavy. What if you are dead in twenty years, and then we'll look back at this? Well, it, in in one year. <laughs> yeah, well, in twenty years we'll be thinking about you. Boy, that's that's really funny, guys. That's a great <laughs> joke. How cool, like Rhett's, I wanna like, this is like the perfect desktop background. That image. Well, why don't you make it your yeah. desktop background, CB? Oh, no, not for me, but. Oh, okay. I'm gonna make my desktop background this Mary-Kate and Ashley quiz we're about to Oh, make. nice segue. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna answer questions. Uh, link in the description if you want to find out which one you are, because we're all one or the other. There's no third option of any human on Earth. You're either Mary-Kate or Ashley Olsen. They played the same character in Full House, but they're not the same person? I know, it's confusing. Like, I know they made a lot of D, uh, VHS or DVD oh, yeah. stuff. Those are the best. At, that all Musicals. you girls were into. So, but, so what, I, what you were saying, well, you were saying they're not the same person, which we know, but they're actually not identical. No, you can tell no. them apart, yeah. But they are. I mean, they are identical, they I mean, are identical yes, they twins. They are identical twins, but you can tell them apart. Somebody told me they that they were. They have different weren't. personalities, Rhett. Oh, and wait, are they not? Different. I uh, look, look that, that up because yeah, yeah. I remember when we had right. this discussion a couple that. years ago, and it was like, no, they're actually mm -hmm. not identical twins. Oh yeah, here's a fun fact: Mary Kate and Ashley Olsen aren't identical twins. Yeah, they're not identical. They just looked so much alike as kids. No, they, they still, still look very much alike. Mm. But they're not genetically identical, and which is why their personalities are different. I mean, Kevin no, could tell that's you that's controversial. I can tell you. You married one, but you could have just as easily have. <laughs> Definitely not married the other. Okay, you passed the test. <laughs> but because because you love your wife as an individual, you're not saying anything negative about her sister. But her sister's a great backup, though, right? <laughs> yes. Isn't that how it works? Okay. Um, Which one do you think you are? You have no did, idea. I don't know the difference between okay. them. Just give me a give me a just a top of the line. Well, from the VHS tapes, uh, because I had several of them. Mary Kate is like the tomboy one, mm -hmm. who's a little wilder. A little and wilder. then Ashley is is more girly girl. Like she Who are they with now? Are they are they in with? relationships? They're both with very old men. I think they're at least one, one of them's married. married. Right? I think Mary Kate's married and yeah, then the other married. one's dating an older man or or reverse. Like I'm talking old old. <laughs> Yeah, okay, he's old. Mary Kate married Olivier Sarko Sarkozy. Sarkozy. Oh, that's Nicolas Sarkozy's brother. The former president of France's brother, right? Yeah, that's right. And then which, what about the other one? She's just dating someone who's extra old, not married yet. That guy doesn't look as old. Ashley's married or Mary Kate's? No, Mary Kate's, Mary Kate's, Kate's married. married. All right, ask me, so ask some questions. Let's well, get to it. The, so based on that description, I don't know. identifiers? Okay, let's get to it. I don't know. I don't know which one. What's your favorite color? Pink, obviously. All shades of blue or black? All shades of blue. Black. Are you doing link? Mm -hmm. Even though I'm wearing blue. She's doing red. We got it. Okay. You meet someone who looks just like you at summer camp, which is awkward because you're posh and need to get back to sabotaging your dad's socialite wedding. You're a tomboy who's just looking for love, or summer camp is for kids. I'm sorry. I was just. Is this Eddie playing? Oh, Eddie's not playing. Okay, yeah, he, he, Eddie, Eddie is trying to he's trying to go to the next thing and it's not going. So Eddie's I, clicks are impotent. Don't pay any attention to him. Yeah, I mean, you're gonna, I'm going to need you to. He killed me. Just I'm upset to the with sound him. Sound of my voice. <laughs> you want me to repeat? Please, I'm sorry. Well, you're either you posh someone, or you're. You just meet, real quick, I'll get it. You meet someone who looks just like you at summer camp, which is awkward because you're posh and you need to get back to sabotaging your dad's socialite wedding. You're a tomboy who's just looking for love. Or summer camp is for kids. Summer camp is for kids. I never think, liked summer camp. I, I'm, a, I'm a tomboy looking for love. 
Always What's looking your go-to catchphrase? What can I say? We're teenagers. <laughs> you got it, dude. Or we think differently. We feel differently. We respond to different things. Or we react to different things. You got it, dude. I like the last one. <laughs> what about differently? Because it, it can't be a catchphrase. Yeah. <laughs> it's a catch sentence. Your ideal day consists of shopping, manicures, and some froyo to top it off, rock music, skateboarding, and loads of eyeliner, running a fashion empire, and dressing boho. Boho? Boho. Y yep, me. <laughs> I.e. me, running a fashion line and dressing boho. I think See, I'm getting in on that. <laughs> it was a it was a manicure, not a pedicure, right? Uh, yes. I don't like the feet touching, but I do like a nice a nice pampering. I got a massage recently, and yeah. I said, "Don't even touch the feet, but don't go easy on me on the back and the shoulders." And I was in I was squirming in pain. It was the That's most good. It was the most painful massage I've ever had. And then I rolled over, and it was Mary Kate Olson. <laughs> No, it's just a woman named Alma. Rolled over. <laughs> okay. You're more likely to wear your hair super sleek and straight, curly and wild, or messy chic is best. I think messy chic, I'm gonna have to go with that. Yours is kind of curly and wild, brother. Is it curly and wild? Yeah. I mean, it's not that wild, it's kind of messy. I mean, it's intentionally messy like this, though. I mean, I... Well, I can't. I'm gonna have to go with the same thing because I can't wear curly. What's the first one? Super, super sleek. sleek and straight. You want me to go with super sleek? I mean, yours is that pretty sl think? pretty sleek, man. Super sleek, yeah. Pretty sleek. You know, that's what I was thinking. Didn't want to say it. Didn't want to aggrandize myself. If you had one day to spend in New York, you would. Oh, I love it. Rock Already. a college interview and totally land a scholarship. Eh. Try your hardest to see your favorite band perform. Mm. Create an avant-garde fashion exhibit that rivals Yeezy season three. I would go on a food tour. I love those. <laughs> <laughs> that's, what, that's what I would do. Those are the best. I would take a nap. Food tours in New York City? Gosh, remember that guy? What was his name? <laughs> they took us around? Hans. No, what was, oh, that dude was so great, man. <laughs> I guess I would. Uh, College, band, or Yeezy. I guess I'd try to see my favorite band. I gotta stay with the fashion. <laughs> okay. How would you describe yourself? I like yourself putting clothes on people. In one word. Oh, they really got to it with this question based on my previous description. Mm -hmm. Girly, tomboy, or unique? You've already said tomboy. So I shouldn't say tomboy again. Well, you need to say consistent. <laughs> really? Unique. Okay, I'll go with tomboy. Results are in. Wait. Okay. Wait. I just Wait. saw a photo of them. Yeah. Are you not seeing it? Wait, go down. It's making you like. You gotta sign up for Link. the. Think you're both. I'm both. Your present day Olsen twins. You're like Michelle on Full House, literally. Wow. Yeah, I am Michelle on Full That's House. That's what they were getting at with those questions. Yeah, but he got, so yours says, you prefer quiet cafes in the big city to the flashing lights of Hollywood red carpets. Yeah, you've given up your career in entertainment, but you traded it in for your true passion, fashion. <laughs> with your best friend at your side, you feel capable of anything and have developed the bohemian style to match your attitude. Mm. Oh, congrats. That's yeah. right. Brett. You're Mary Kate. You're not afraid of getting dirty. People have used the word tomboy to describe you yeah. frequently. So have I, twice. <laughs> but you just embrace wearing plaid and playing sports. <laughs> Although you rely on your family to get you out like of a lumberjack playing sports. situations, you always have the best intentions. I've always got the best intentions with my, you know, chic, messy hair and mm -hmm. sports. <laughs> <laughs> I've got an outfit perfect for you, though. Thanks for sticking around for Good Mythical More. If you want to watch more, well, we don't have Good Mythical More More, but we do have a lot more videos. Here's two of them. Also, click the circular channel icon to subscribe.